because there if is. that person, yeah, if that person goes for genetic testing, maybe they have a genetic mutation that that um, linked them to that cancer that their mother or sister had, right? Um, or if there was no mutation, just having that family history puts you at a, a significant percent higher than baseline population for that cancer. So, yes, I think with these cancers that we have no early detection for, if you're done with, done with childbearing, and more specifically, if you already have entered menopause, I think that's the, the key, right? Because you may be done with childbearing at like 40, 45, right. but you're still premenopausal, so you're not ready to get rid of your ovaries and go into menopause. Okay. Um, but I would say the patients that I meet, and I meet many patients like this all the time, they'll come to me, they went to genetic testing, genetic testing ne- negative, but their mom had ovarian cancer at 65, yeah. um, their sister had uterine cancer at 50, whatever it is, but there's no genetic link to anything, and this patient is um, 47.